Bhakpa Mandal's appointment as the Group General Counsel at the House of Tata. Zia Modi of AZB Partners joins us. Zia, thanks very much for joining us. Shiva started his career at AZB, so in that sense, it's also a big day for all of you. It certainly is. It absolutely is. Uh, wh how do you uh, explain uh, this move by the House of Tatars? Bharat Vasani putting in 17 years there, expressing his desire to move on to a much more strategic and advisory role. We understand that he will continue in an advisory capacity advising uh, Chandra. But uh, uh, what do you believe has, has tilted the odds in favor of Shuva? I think it's, uh, it's an elegant uh, um, situation, I think, for both. Bharat Vasani has a long-term Tata insider, clearly of great value for his institutional memory uh, and all the work that he has put in for the house. Uh, Shuva, I think, has uh, very much shown uh, the group his mettle in his uh, recent, uh, uh, in the recent case where, uh, you know, there was this... Uh, obvious uh, very public uh, fight between uh, the house and uh, Cyrus Mystery. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think that uh, given the results, uh, he has no doubt uh, inspired the confidence of the house and Tata Sons. So I think that uh, probably um, a job very well done, um, uh, 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 an extremely bright uh, lawyer, uh, strategic and tactical uh, and therefore Bharat mm -hmm. uh, in his new role and Shua in his present role should certainly give much comfort to Chandra. Speaking of uh, giving comfort to Chandra, as you pointed out that Shuva has played an important role uh, in the bitter boardroom battle that's played out uh, involving Cyrus Mystery and the House of Tatars. But he also understands the group well, does he not, uh, Zia? Because I understand that he's worked uh, as a legal advisor for companies like Tata Motors, for Tata Chemicals, on uh, various international projects as well. So uh, the transition, so to speak, for Shuva is likely to be an easy one, would it not? Uh, quite easy because, uh, you know, Shuva's father is a Tata man at Jamshedpur. So Shuva grew up in Jamshedpur. Uh, and then when Shuva joined us, we were his, uh, the first firm that he joined in 2000. I think Shuva must have worked on almost every important international Tata MA, 90% of them, if not. Uh, uh, more and uh, therefore, I think uh, Shuvas connect with all the Tata CEOs and the opera, the CFOs, etc. is not something which is new to him. He knows these boys and girls for a long time. Uh, you know, Ms. Modi, uh, as far as uh, the legal challenges are concerned, uh, Shiva will have his hands full. And as you were pointing out, and as Shireen was saying as well, uh, he has been closely advising the Tata Sons, but he will be taking a more uh, hands-on approach now. What do you think would be the key challenges that he will have before him immediately? <laughs> I don't need to speak for Shiva. Uh, Shuva has been one of my brightest lawyers. He will figure out the role that he has to play for himself. And I'm sure he will do it exquisitely. I think the challenges are going to be the same that any group would face. Uh, international, regulatory, um, all the litigation that goes on, the high value uh, issues that come to bear, the firefighting that any GC has to do. I think that uh, it's not going to be different uh, uh, than yesterday. Uh, and I just think that, you know, Shuva obviously has thought about it, is geared up for it, is ready for it, and will do a fabulous job. Uh, as a mentor, Zia, what would, what would your advice be to Shuva? <laughs> I've already given him that advice, so I don't have to repeat it on air. All right, you've already... Uh, I, I was hoping for a sneak peek at what you actually told him. No, I think that's between me and him. 
<laughs> All right, Zia. Okay. Thanks very much for joining us. Zia Modi there of AZB Bath is uh, reacting to the news that's coming in of Shuva Mandal joining as group legal counsel, House of Tatas. This is the second uh, big appointment that the Tata group has made in the past 24 hours. Yesterday, appointing Saurabh Agrawal as the group CFO and today Shiva Mandal as a group legal counsel. Bharat Masani will stay on in an advisory capacity after putting in 17 years at the House of Tatas. But coming